Yes guys, welcome back to another episode of When Men Stop Simping for Women. As always, let's get straight into it. Yeah, nah, it's not gonna happen. Just cause we're on live TV in front of my family, don't think I'm gonna change or act different. Don't try to take my phone. You ain't gonna see what's on it. You don't need to see what's on it. Leave me alone. Hey, I'm sitting here getting a massage from Stink. Happy birthday, daddy. What the f did you just say? I'm sorry, my lord. What are you sorry for? I'm sorry for calling you daddy because you are not my father. Emphasis on not. I am not your father. That's crazy to me. And you know what? I hate to hear it now. You're going to hate to hear it. You're a P4 now. No, my lord. Does thou talk in the back? I'm sorry, my lord. <sighs> you are acting very strange. And, and, on, and on my birthday? <sighs> Strawberry. Napkin. Fiji. Mm, mm. Now, obviously, this is a skit. It's funny as fuck. I think that guy's a comedian or something. And to be fair, this girl's got a good sense of humor for playing along. Beautiful day in Florida, dog. For real, man. Hey, 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 hey. Get your regular ass out my shot, dog. You're crazy, dog. I don't even know that. Man, my guy's just trying to have a nice little stroll on the beach, enjoying his day, and then her raggedy ass, as he says it, comes and jumps into the picture. He took her out of the picture as quickly as she came in it, though. At a certain age group, young girls develop, they're gonna get a lot of attention, young boys are simply not. He's gonna witness his female counterparts on TikTok, 10,000 followers, 20,000, 30,000, million followers. What does that do to the dynamics and the hierarchy on campus? Can he get this girl now? He has no chance, and he's gonna grow up with them through high school, Believing I have no chance at women. The self-esteem of this kid is going to get killed. The only thing he can reach out now to are Instagram thoughts and photography. Man, girls develop quicker. They can have an older guy. They can live an adult life. So when you're a younger guy and you're their age and you see them doing that, you feel like you need to do that. You feel like you need to be the man from a younger age. And then when you can't get girls like that, you get frustrated. You turn to photography, you turn to Instagram. But you ain't got to worry, I've told you this a lot of times. As a man, if you focus on yourself and you build your own life, your value increases. As you get older, you're gonna become that guy that they're chasing now. So you ain't got to worry right now. Don't worry about that shit. Hey Maddie, if you don't have feet, is there a point to you wearing socks? No. If you don't have hands, is there a point to you wearing gloves? No. And why do you wear a bra? Yo, that one there was a violation. Let's be honest, physical attraction is the first thing that draws you to a person. Especially our generation, like, we're fickle as fuck. A lot of people just want to get in relationships just because someone looks good next to them. But that's not going to give you no longevity. Like, you got to form a real fucking bond and mental connection to be with someone for a long time. Otherwise, they're going to do your head in. Even if the girl is physically perfect to you, she will do your fucking head in if she's completely different to you and she's not on the same page as you. I think this sneaky link is toxic, it's dumb as fuck, but anyway, if you're gonna be a sneaky link, you gotta stay that way. You're not meant to catch feelings, but the problem is a lot of women aren't capable of not catching feelings. You my girl, you sleep over at my crib, the first thing you're not gonna do is mm, and try to put your tongue in my mouth in the morning, you feel me? Go brush your beak, your breath stinks cause it's disrespectful. I'm glad someone said it, we ain't living in a perfect Hollywood movie, do you know what I mean? When you wake up, you look fresh faced, the birds are singing, the sun's shining, and her breath smells like polo mints it just doesn't happen i don't really want to be doing all the kissing in the morning do you know what i mean your breath stinks like he says my breath stinks we ain't got to smell that it's the same thing when we just been smashing for a long time we're both sweating and then you want to come cuddle i mean i don't want to cuddle after that i'm just trying to relax i want to have a shower then i want to eat see men their focus is women no. am i right <laughs> And how's a six-year-old wiser than the grown man? And if your focus is completely on women, your main focus is on women, you got a problem. you got to get some other focus in your life. And I tell you what, a lot of women are attracted to men that have a passion and something that they focus on in life. Don't let someone else be your be your and end all. Your main focus should be yourself. If you're not the best you can be, how are you going to give your best to someone else? 
going, bro. If you walk through that door, we're done. If you walk through that door, if you walk through that door, we're done. Wow. This man is a genius. He didn't walk through the door. He rolled out the door. So technically, it's not over. So this guy is going viral because his baby mama decided to bleach all of his clothes. And... And he turned it into drip. Could you imagine putting this much effort into making somebody miserable? Just for them to be well known for it and look pretty stylish. He could have gone and got his revenge in some other way. He could have gone and done the same thing to her clothes and done someone else bad, right? But instead, nah, kill him with success. Turn that negative into a positive. Still though, the fact she tried to mess up all his clothes, man, I don't know what he did, but still, there's only one place she belongs for that. She belongs to the street.